You should stay in the school education system and learn more, apply what you already know, make relationships that will help you in the future. This talk is about five hyper skills you should learn in school. I will try to teach my kids and at my future school. The first skill is to learn how to learn. Listen till the end and subscribe. Welcome to Enrich Talks, the original kind of content you will never find elsewhere. It is written from experience, from pain and faith. I was talking to a young boy and he said he can't wait to grow up and finish school and start working. My question was, if he thinks that life after school is greater, better and easier, because he must wake up early and go to work daily, without interruptions, 20 days, holidays in a year, problems with people, with system and always depending on what other decide it is better for you, or you must do what they want. To have someone to be obedient, to be paid as much as the company wants, nearly above poverty line, still enough not to look for another workplace, to be a servant. Modern corporatist slave or a pawn in other people's money system making machine. Instead of learning, acquire skills and experiences, learn for yourself and for your better future. In Bible it is written, you should be head, not tail. I add. You should be leader not just another follower. I have almost 20 of working for others, I am tired, exhausted, enough stress and waking at 4 in the morning. These 5 life skills are priceless, and I discovered them becoming a member of a Protestant church. These people teach their kids how to memorize, to learn and understand. From Bible verses, to poems, other books, songs, musical instruments from early age, to learn how to learn, is better than learning a specific skill, that the child may hate when he grow up. The second skill is creativity. To write a text, make art, grow imagination. I have a friend who is a website's developer, but he lack imagination. His websites are ugly, simple and cheap. Imagination and creativity brings the added value. The third skill is people, emotional intelligence, not necessary to manipulate or influence people, still you could learn how to lead people, sell anything and make them trust you. The skills number four is a foreign language and culture, traditions, way of living, meeting and interact with foreigners. This way your mind will create other solutions to problems. And skill number five is solving life problems, solving, repairing, helping, finding solutions. It is a combination between work ethic, discipline and knowledge. Also character, good life values, habits, life principles, and life path, purpose and place in society. In description of this video you find other interesting talks, and also my ebook called, Solve Your Life Problems.